What's going on guys? Back at it again with another Fallout 3 video. So I'm going to be upfront about everything and be honest with you guys in saying that I really wasn't a fan of Melee in this game. I've never in my life tried Melee in Fallout 3 or New Vegas for that matter. But for the sake of this video, I've never played Melee in Fallout 3. So I figured I would give it a shot here for the channel. And unfortunately, I just didn't like it. I wasn't enjoying it as much as I thought I would. And that's really unfortunate. So, considering the fact that I already had, you know, set up my special stats and and uh, set up some of my uh, my perks and everything like that in favor of, you know, the 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 whole melee situation, I kind of sorta don't have any choice but to restart the game, which is what I'm planning to do here. Uh, I've always liked laser rifles, so I think I'm just gonna go with something in that direction, but we'll see. But as for now, let's go ahead and start a new game. Alright, we are actually going to skip that because it's copyrighted and you guys saw that in the first video. So, yep. <laughs> let's go ahead and try to avoid all of that, right? Alright, another thing we're going to do is definitely try to skip all of this. Okay, I'm a boy. It's a boy. I guess. <laughs> a boy. We've got a son, Catherine. A beautiful, healthy baby boy. Yeah, I kind of want to get into the gameplay, so I'm, I literally am just going to try to rush through the whole beginning portion of the game. My beautiful son. You've got a bright future ahead of you, son. Yes, sir. I'm sure of it. Look at you. Look at you. Hi there. I'm your daddy, little guy. Daddy. You're going to need a name, aren't you? Your mother and I have been talking. What do you think about... I'm going with the same name, so... That's oh. a good name. No! You Fits you perfectly. <laughs> Looks like they finished the gene projection. Let's see what you Oh my like god. Oh. I think I can change that anyways. Um let's see here. We'll go we'll go with the normal look, man. All right, we'll go with that. Switch hairstyles definitely getting changed out. Uh tunnel snakes. That doesn't look too bad. Um you know, we're going to go with Sarge. Yeah, we're going to go with Sarge. And then, of course, we're going with black hair. Black. And then, beard. Should we go with the beard? Let's see here. Um... You know what? Uh... We'll go, we'll go with, uh, just a rough little beard here. Alright, yes, I want to, I want this to be my character. If I can't You're going to look a lot like change a my name See back that, to Amerigamer, I'm going to be pissed. Oh, oh very strapping. <laughs> it's a big world out there, son, full of all sorts of people. What about you? What kind of person are you going to be? The gangster James. kind. No, I'm just kidding. James. She's in cardiac James. arrest. Start compression. James. Get the baby out of here. Move! Move! One, one thousand. Two, one thousand. Come on. Hang on, Catherine. Hang on. That's always unfortunate. We need a doctor, not a dead man. This one's on the house. Fail to meet my expectations. No, don't look evil. straight into the light. Now. James and his cheerly chatter. Decorations. Hey, your future's a great boys in this place will feel just like a mom. All right, let's go ahead and go in here so we can get trapped. Walk to daddy. There you go. My goodness. Just a year old and already walking like a pro. You know it. would have been so proud. Listen, kiddo. I know you don't like it when daddy leaves you alone. But I need you to take care of yourself for a minute. You just stay here while Daddy runs to his office. You'll be okay, pal. I'll be back in a bit. Sounds good. 
Let me out, damn it. Alright, now let's set our special. Uh, we'll go with four. Four. Nine. Uh, two for charisma. Intelligence, we'll put this at nine. Um, agility, we'll put this at six. And luck, we'll put this at six. And that should be good. Hold on, let me see. Let me read all this stuff. All right, luck is for... L is for luck, and it's simple. You see, it means all the good things happen to me. Okay, this is just set up to be a nursery rhyme. So let's go ahead and... I already opened it, damn it. Let's go, hurry up. I got business to take care of outside in the wasteland. What's up, Pops? <laughs> you are quite the little explorer. You, you know it. That was me right for trying to pin you in. Come on over here. I want to show you something. See that? It was your mother's favorite passage. It's from the Bible. Revelation 21.6. I am Alpha and Omega. The beginning and the end. I will give unto him that is a thirst of the fountain of the water of life freely. She always loved that. All right, come on. Let's go see if your little friend Amado wants to play. Let's go. Follow dad. The only thing I wish this game had was sprint. The experiment to prepare. And that uh, that goes the same with New Vegas, man. Stanley, you turned the lights on too fast. You blinded the poor kid. Happy birthday! Happy birthday to me! He is growing up so fast. Happy birthday, pal! I can't believe you're already ten. I'm so proud of you. If only you. Congratulations, mother. young man. I don't have to tell you how special this day is, do I? Down here in Vault 101, when you turn 10, well, you're ready to take on your first official vault responsibilities. So here you are. As overseer, I hereby present to you your very own Pip Boy 3000. Get used to it. Yeah, You'll yeah. be getting your first work assignment tomorrow. <laughs> Enjoy your party. You're only ten once, so have fun. Awesome. Happy birthday! We really surprised you, didn't we? <laughs> your dad was afraid you were on to us. But I told him not to worry. You're so easy to fool. Um, great party, Amada. Thanks for doing this for me. You're welcome. But really, your dad did most of it. I just helped with the decorations and stuff. Hey, I bet you can't guess what I got you for your birthday. Go on, guess. Um, I really have no idea. Ha, I knew I surprised you. Who's your favorite barbarian? That's right, Grognak, issue 14, and with no missing pages. I found what? this in a box of my father's old things, believe it or not. Imagine him reading comic books. I guess everybody was 10 once. Well, I better let you get back to mingling with your guests. We'll talk later, okay? Happy birthday. Thanks, Amada. You're a sweetheart. Oh, man. Are you having a nice party? Ten years old. My, my, my. Seems like only yesterday that your daddy came. Goodness, listen to me ramble. You're waiting for your present, aren't you? Duh. Yes, ma'am. Such a nice, polite young man you are. Don't ever lose your gift to speaking your mind so directly. We could use more of that down here. Here you go. A nice sweet roll that I baked for you just this morning. And it's all for you. You're the birthday boy. No sharing required today. Why, thank you. This party's pretty good. Not as cool Oops. as my party, though. Remember how my dad got Andy to do magic tricks? And we all played Hunt the Mutant in the atrium? Oh, right. You weren't invited to my party. Too bad, man. It was really fun. <laughs> Alrighty, you. Okay, forget you then. Uh, you. How do you like that, Pip Boy, son? Fit all right and everything? 
Uh, it's really cool. Did you fix it up for me? As a matter of fact, I did. I'm glad you like it. Some may think the A series is a bit basic, but I've always preferred them for their reliability. Thanks, Stanley. Don't mention it. Oh, yes, I almost forgot. Happy birthday. Not much, but I hope you like it. Cool, I got a new, nice little baseball cap. How's it going, pal? Allow me to wish you a happy birthday. Happy birthday. <laughs> Good one, Butch. Uh-oh. 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 Uh-o
All right, where where's old boy at? There he is. What are What's you up, doing down here, young man? You told me to come I down here. I thought kids weren't allowed down on the reactor level. Uh. Oh, but Dad told me it was okay to come down here. Hey, relax. I was just teasing. Listen, now that you're ten, you don't have to take guff like that from grown-ups anymore. Got it? <laughs> yeah, I don't Hold think that's how it me. works. I think your dad will want to give you the surprise himself. If he decides to come. There he is. What's up, Dad? Are you ready for your surprise? Uh, what kind of surprise? The overseer gave you your pit boy, and you're old enough to do some work. So, I figure you're old enough for this. Your own BB gun. What? It's a little old, but it should work perfectly. Jonas found it down here. It was in pretty rough shape. Took us a good three months to find the parts to get it working again. You know how tough it is to find a spring that small? Good thing Butch must place that switchblade of his. <laughs> so, what do you think? Want to give it a try? Yeah, of course. Here? We can't shoot a gun here. We sure can't, unless we want the overseer beating down our door. Jonas and I have found a place, though. Come on. Yup, yup. Right behind you, Dad. Gotta blast some people with this BB gun. Who do I get to blast? Ooh, can I shoot the reactor? Well, what do you think? You can come down here and shoot anytime you want. This is great, Dad. Thanks. Couldn't have done it without Jonas's help. You make sure to thank him. Oh, of course. He's an awesome guy. Uh, fire. Fire. F Damn it, I missed. Yes, I can. Dude, I'm a natural. Good work. That's one less round roach to deal with. Let's get a picture together. Capture the moment. We'll hey, do, Jones, Dad. Get a picture of me with the big game, Hunter. The big game? That's not even small game. Smile. That's just a joke. <laughs> Boys and girls have different parts. Is there a problem anyway? So, I'm the overseer's daughter, so what? That like, I get any kind of special treatment. Revelation 21-6. I am Alpha and Omega. The beginning and the end. As far as I can tell, you're a perfectly healthy 16-year-old boy. So, yes, you have to go to class to take your GOAT exam. Go on now. You've got a GOAT to take. Uh, if you say so, Dad. Hey, it's not my call. Those are the rules. You're 16 now, so this year you take the goat. Come on, it's not so bad. Everyone has to take it. You'll do just fine. Dad, I think you're misunderstanding. I think what you meant to say uh, is that I'm goat. The greatest of all time. Bye, Dad. Take care, son. Now get out of here, and good luck. Will do. All right, medicine bobblehead. What's up, Jonas? Good morning. Get out of my way, you stupid tunnel snakes! Rule. Uh, hold on. Much tunnel snake. You. Yeah. What do you want? What's going on here? None of your my business, cough. kid. Get out of here before you get hurt. If you mess with the tunnel snakes. You're asking for it. Got me? Uh... Leave her alone or you'll answer to me. And who are you? Her boyfriend? Ha! Keep talking like that, boy. And we'll send you back to your daddy with a few broken bones for him to fix. You really want to go this route? Uh... That's it, Butch. You and me, right now. You've got to be kidding me. Come on, tunnel snakes. This twerp needs another lesson. Here we go. What's up, homie? Let's do this. Uh, please stop fighting. Hit him again. Oh, sorry, Wally. This isn't solving anything. I'm going after Butch. Give him another. Stop it. 
How do you like that? Point, that oh, oh, shut up, Butch. Okay, okay. You win. We'll leave the little girl alone. You're not worth our time anyway. It's because you lost. Come on, Tunnel Snakes. We're out of here. I there beat you, you Paul, and You're Wally Mac. Tunnel Snakes rule. Oh, wait. Hey, uh, Amada. Thanks, thanks for getting rid of them. <laughs> Assholes. <laughs> I don't know why they won't leave me alone. Just because my father's the overseer, I guess? Dude, they Idiots. like you. Go. All right, let's go. Oh, not much. Well, you made it. All set for the goat? Trust me, it really isn't that bad. Just something everybody has to go through. Uh. Come on, I don't really have. Nah, you know what? Sure, I'll take it. I'm sure you will. Especially since it's multiple choice with no wrong answers. <laughs> we'll start as soon as everyone's found a seat. Good luck. Thank you. I got the front seat. Will everybody sit down already? We're trying to take the class. Well, now that everyone has managed to find the classroom, we can finally get started. No talking, and keep your eyes to yourselves. <laughs> yes, I'm talking to you, Mr. Deloria. Sure thing, Mr. Brach. Unless anyone else has an insightful comment, let's get started. Question one. A frenzied vault scientist runs up to you and yells, I'm going to put my quantum harmonizer in your photonic resonation chamber. What's your response? Uh... But doctor, wouldn't that cause a parabolic dis uh, destabilization of the fusion singularity? Question two. While working as an intern in the clinic, a patient with a strange infection in his foot stumbles through the door. The infection is spreading at an alarming rate, but the doctor has stepped out for a while. What do you do? Uh... Uh, medicate the infected area to the best of your abilities. Question three. You discover a young boy lost in the lower levels of the vault. He's hungry and frightened, but also appears to be in possession of stolen property. What do you do? Shoot him in the face. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, confiscate the stole. No. Uh, lead the boy to safety and then turn him into the overseer. Question four. Congratulations. You've made one of the Vault 101 baseball teams. Which position do you prefer? Designated hitter. Question five. Your grandmother invites you to tea. But you're surprised when she gives you a pistol and orders you to kill another vault resident. What do you do? Um. Offer your most prized possession for the resident's life. Question six. Old Mr. Abernathy has locked himself in his quarters again. And you've been ordered to get him out. How do you proceed? Uh, use the bobby pin, uh, to pick the lock on the door. Question seven. Oh no, you've been exposed to radiation, and a mutated hand has grown out of your stomach. What's the best course of treatment? Uh, take large doses of anti-mutagen agent. Question eight. A fellow Vault 101 resident is in possession of a Grognak the Barbarian comic book. Issue number one. You want it. What's the best way to obtain it? Trade the comic for one of the uh, one of your own valuable possessions. Question nine. You decide it would be fun to play a prank on your father. You enter his private restroom when no one is looking and... Mm. Uh, I guess we'll put a firecracker in the toilet. Uh, that'll show cause some mayhem. 10. Who is indisputably the most important person in Vault 101? Me. He who shelters us from the harshness of the atomic wasteland, and to whom we owe everything we have, including our lives. Me. Pencils down, people. That's it. 
infamous goat. I like how all the I'm answers sure were the overseer. So bad. Others, well, there are always openings in the maintenance department. <laughs> don't forget to hand in your test before you leave. You don't want to know what happens to people who fail the goat. You can have the rest of the day off to celebrate or to pray. As the fail the warns. goat? Didn't he say there was no wrong answers? How do you fail something there's no wrong answers to? Hey there. Wait a minute. Am I supposed to do something? They say the goat never lies. According to this, you're slated to be the next vault chaplain. <laughs> God help us all. That's funny. Uh... Wow, that's what I've always wanted to be. My dreams are finally coming true. Yes, um, it's refreshing to see such, uh, youthful enthusiasm. Good to know that the goat occasionally gets it right. You know what they say about monkeys and typewriters. Well, <laughs> I'm glad things turned out so well for you. I hope your classmates find their results half as satisfying. Alright, so I guess we'll go with... We'll take definitely these two off. Barter, energy weapons, and, uh... I mean, I guess speech? Uh... Barter, energy weapons... Actually, you know what? Let's go with repair. That'll definitely come in handy for sure. Yep. Hey. Hi. Here you are, Mr. Brach. I hope I did okay. Exit the classroom. Get out of my way, Butch, before you get another beating. Wake up! Come on, wake up! I'm not going to be around to hold your hand forever. Come on! You've got to wake up! Dun dun dun. Uh... What's wrong, Amada? You've got to get out of here. Your dad is gone and my father's men are looking for you. Wait a minute, what do you mean my dad is gone? He's left the vault. I don't know how, but he's gone. And my father, he's kind of gone crazy. Uh, I've never seen you so scared, Amato. What happened? It's Jonas! They killed him! Who killed my him? My father's men. They took him and... Oh my god, you have to leave now. You ain't gotta tell me twice. Oh my god, are you okay? Yeah, don't worry about me. I'm just sorry you had to find out like this. I know Jonas was your friend. But we've got to go now. My father's men will be here any minute. Uh, my dad can't have left. The door's sealed shut. Not anymore, apparently. But are you honestly telling me you had no idea your dad was leaving? He really didn't tell you? No, I had no idea what he, uh, he was planning to leave. Oh, I'm sorry. I I'm sure he had his reasons. Maybe Jonas was supposed to explain everything to you? But it doesn't matter. I can help you escape. I have my own plan. Escape the vault? How? Listen, there's a secret tunnel that leads directly from my father's office to the exit. You'll have to hack the computer in his office to open it. Use these to get into his office. That's how I always get in. Uh, sounds like a plan. Let's get out of here. Oh, one more thing. I stole my father's pistol. I hope you won't need it, but you'd better take it just in case. Uh, thanks, Amada. I'll only use it as a last resort, I promise. Okay. I'll try to meet you at the exit. Watch out for security. Good luck. Thank you. All right. Well, first things first. I'm taking my BB I'll gun. Meet you at the vault door if I can. That was a gift for my dad. Don't wait for me. Uh, let's actually equip. Uh, we'll equip the 10 millimeter pistol for now. Only because it does more damage, and I'm probably gonna, you know, toss it when we're done here. All right, deuces. Oh no, wait, wrong way. Run! You gotta help me. My mom's trapped in there with the rat roaches. <laughs> I can't even see you, bro. Uh, come on, let's see if we can help her. No. Don't worry, Butch. I'll get your mom out of there since you're a wimp. Uh, I think it's this way. Ah! Uh, don't die! Ah! 
Okay. We're definitely gonna have to do vats, cause... No. Alright, we'll do two here. And then two to this guy. Oh my god, I'm upstairs. Are you gonna die or what? I can't believe this guy didn't die. No, wait, go back. Uh, oh, oh, oh. Nope, give me that body. Oh no! Woo, that was close. We did it! My mom's gonna be okay. You're the best friend I've ever had, man. You know what, first hey, of all... I know it isn't much. Alright, yes, give me your tunnel snakes. First of all, you didn't do anything, alright? It was me. All me. You're just a weenie. I'm already running low on, uh... Oh god. Who is this? Aw, oh, it's the grandma. Uh, I already have this, so I'm leaving. Laters. Atrium. Oh god. I'm go. I'm running. It's our only. Alright, this is where the guy dies. So we're getting out of here, just like the doctor. I'm not gonna let anyone stop us. As soon as he takes off, me. I'm going. Let's go. Good. That way they don't shoot me in the process. Get out of the way. Okay, admin. Luckily, we've been through this before, so... You shut up. I know you're going to talk shit, but it's okay, though. I don't care. Run away. Sorry, Amada. I knew you'd turn up sooner or later. Ah, run! I don't want to kill you! Alright, I'll definitely take these eyeglasses. Note from Dad. Can I read this? Not from here. And I'll take that too. Screw it! Oh no, I have to do this? Oh god. Alright, it's gotta be this way then. There we go. Run! Yes, we already know all this lore. We've read through it before. Come on. Oh, God. There we go. Alright, open Overseer's Tunnel. Oh, shit. The guy's right here. <laughs> Ring around the rosies. Deuces. Run. We're getting chased by all kinds of things right now. But we're on a mission to get out of here, alright? And that's what we're gonna do. If it's the last thing we do. Wait, what the hell? Alright, this way. Let's go. Hi, Amada. Oh, actually opened it. All right, here, talk to me real quick. I would make it. My, my, my father, he, I, my officer Mac, I, I didn't tell them anything. I swear. When the warning sirens came on, they all ran out. I, I guess that was you. I, I see you got the door open. That's good. I'm sorry, Amada, but I couldn't risk helping you. They, w uh, they would have killed me. You're right, I understand. It was crazy for me to think you could stop them. What's important is that you made it. You got the door open. You should come with me. It's not safe for you to stay. Don't worry about me. Whatever happens, I'm sure I'll be in less danger than you. I can't imagine what you're going to find out there. Go on, before anyone comes. Find your dad. I'll... I'll miss you. You've been a good friend. Bye, Amada. Ha ha ha! bye! Yeah, you're pretty damn crazy. Alright, yes, edit name. That's exactly what I want. So let's go ahead and name him Amerigamer. There we go. And then that'll be our name. Nope, yep, alright. Ray Sex 
tag skills, finish, exit, vault. All right, we should be fine. And just like that, we are now good to go. Oh my God, that thing is loud. So we need to find a laser rifle. That much is for sure. Oh, we actually leveled up in the process. Uh, let's go put it all in laser, in uh, energy weapons. All right. Uh, so let's see here. Daddy's boy. Um. No. Little Leaguer, definitely not. Lady Killer. That seems pretty decent. Um. See, I, I definitely gotta put in stuff to like, like Bloody Mess, for example. But for now, I guess we will put Lady Killer, I guess. In combat, you do 10% more damage against female opponents outside of combat. You'll sometimes... Yeah, we'll put it in this for now, I guess. Since it gives us a little bit more damage to the opposite sex. So let's go ahead... Okay, yes, now we gotta get spammed by all the DLC stuff. So let's go ahead and make our way into Megaton. And then we'll probably end it right there a little short. And then we'll actually continue in the next video on normal gameplay. But we're, just for the record though, we're probably going to rush in the next few episodes or whatever. Uh, just because we've already been through all of this, so I kind of want to catch up. Luckily, we weren't too far, so it's not gonna take very long. Keep it on. I'm just here. Oh wait, you're not the guard. You. Ah, uh, welcome, weary traveler. Well, one. Uh, I'm here to buy. See what the good doctor has in his magic bag. Ooh, Shall this we? guy has schematics for nuka grenades. All right, I was just curious. You look very nice, by the way. Thank you. All right, let's go ahead and talk to uh, Sheriff uh, You're from that vault, Sims vault 101. Why, yes, I am, sir. Name's Lucas Sims, town sheriff, and mayor, too, when the need arises. I don't know why, but I like you, boy. Something tells me you're all right. So welcome to Megaton. Just holler if you need something. Uh, Nice town you got here, Sheriff. It's a pleasure to meet you. Friendly and well-mannered. I think we're gonna get along just fine. You treat my people nice, and you're welcome to stay as long as you'd like. Right. Message received. I'm glad we understand each other. Now, is there something I can help you with? Of course. Uh, I'm looking for my father. Middle-aged guy, maybe you've seen him? Nope. Sorry. I got enough fires to put out in this place that I don't have time to keep tabs on every visitor. I'd ask around town. Uh, well, I mean, since we're on the subject of the town, I could definitely use some directions. Sure thing, partner. What do you need to find? Uh, well, everything. But first things first, uh, I think weapons are the important thing right now. So, do you know where the weapons dealer is around here? You'll probably want to see Moira at Craterside Supply. She sells some weapons. Makes some, too, from what I hear. Her place is down by the crater. Oh, okay, cool. What about the clinic? Our clinic is down in the crater, by the bomb. Doc Church is a little rough around the edges, but the man's got talent and compassion. Oh, sounds like a pretty good situation there. Uh, is there a bar in town, just in case you not want to uh, release some stress and just catch like a couple swigs of something? Sure is. Moriarty's. The entrance is on the top level, opposite the main gate. 
Just be careful. Moriarty is not your friend, no matter what he may say. So don't fall for his lies. And for God's sake, don't trust the man. Oh, noted. Uh, well, I do need some equipment, by the way. Where's the nearest general store? Moira sells all kinds of stuff at their place. Trader side supply. Take a guess where it is. <laughs> yeah. So she's the arms dealer and the armor place. Uh, what if I decide to rent a bed? Up at Moriarty's at the south end of town. Talk to Nova. She'll help you out. Okay, cool. So it looks like uh, Crater Side Supply and Moriarty's are the place to go, sounds like. But that's enough for the directions. Let's see if we can sure talk about thing. something else, sir. What's on your mind? Uh, so can you tell me what's up with this bomb? What about it? Don't you think someone should disarm that thing? I don't trust any of the locals to tinker with it. Besides, most people don't even realize it's still a threat. And hell, Cromwell and those crazies from the Church of Adam, they worship the damn thing. Why? You think you got the know-how to disarm it? For good? I mean, I can see about disarming that bomb for you if that's what you'd like. Oh, all right. Fine. But listen here. Just take a look at it. Go easy. If you get the job done, there'll be 100 caps in it for you. Uh. Hundred caps? All right, I'll take a look at it. Great. Go ahead and see what you can do. Just be careful. Uh, let's see. Know anything about the area outside of Megaton? It's called the Wasteland for a reason. But there are settlements, too, spread all around. The human race is stubborn like that. To the south, you've got Rivet City. But don't bother going to D.C. The place is a war zone. Uh, now that I'm helping you, maybe you can help me. I'm looking for my dad. Well, come to think of it, I do remember a stranger coming through here. Had a look in his eye. You know the kind a man gets when he's got a purpose. Spend some time up in the saloon. Might want to check with Moriarty. Just watch yourself. That man's trouble. Yep. Sounds like it by uh, your warning. Um. Tell me more about your town. What do you want to know? Does this... Well, actually, I've already... I already know all of this. So, yep, let's talk all something right, else. Shoot. And then let's go ahead and go. Thank you. Mind your manners now. I got my eye on you. I didn't Don't do anything stupid. Okay, I got it. Thank you. Bye. Carry on. All right, let's see if I could even yeah. disarm this damn bomb. He is coming with the clouds. Uh, so I need twenty-five explosives. And Where am I at with explosives? Um, special skills 13. Even if I take a magazine, I think that only does 10. I wouldn't have enough. So this is going to prove to be somewhat difficult. So we're definitely going to have to come back with that mission some other time. Well, uh, but as for now, we're definitely going to call it a video. Uh, if this is a series that you guys are enjoying, I know I you did me melee before. I didn't like it, so now I'm going to try to take a crack at laser rifles. I have always loved laser rifles, so this is, I'm pretty sure it's something I'm going to definitely like in this game. But if that's something you guys are interested in seeing, do me a huge favor and drop a like in this video. Also, subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed because it really does help this channel grow. So with that being said, catch you guys in the next video. Deuces.